What does the neighborhood playhouse mean to you? So, uh, it's, it's kind of like the start of my career. Like, in a way, because I Welcome back everyone, it is week two, episode three, and in this episode I'm going to be explaining a lot more about the Neighborhood Playhouse, I'm going to be talking to people, I'm going to be introducing some new things, and actually I want to show you guys my apartment because I didn't do that yet, and I, I think you guys would be interested, so one second. Alright, so before we go on, I just wanted to show you guys my apartment and what it looks like where I'm staying. So. This is the door. No, I'm just kidding. So, so this is the kitchen. This is where I eat food. The living room. This is my breakfast. And then here's the bedroom. There's a mantle and a mirror. And over here is the bathroom. There's not much to it. Oof. That was bright. And then we have this little window. And that leads to the... Fire escape. And lastly, we have this picture. This is a real cool picture of. But that's about it. There's not much to it. It's a small little space. It's it's pretty nice. It's only five blocks away from the school, so it's not a hassle to to leave or get up or get ready. Well, I'm gonna head to school now and I'll see you guys out there. So while I'm at school, you guys are going to be watching this new segment that I'm going to be adding to my channel. And as of right now, the name is called Zach's Zappers. And basically it's going to be information or history about certain places and specifically this one, it's going to be the Neighborhood Playhouse. Now I've been recently doing some audiobooks, so I thought why not just integrate that into my vlogs as well. And I thought you guys would like that too. So I'm gonna be in class and I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you after. Sanford Meisner, also known as Sandy, was an American actor and acting teacher who developed an approach to acting instruction that is now known as the Meisner Technique. Meisner was part of a theater group called the Group Theater, along with many other famous instructors and actors such as Lee Strasberg, Stella Adler, and 25 others who eventually derived their own acting techniques from the system of Stanislavski. The Neighborhood Playhouse had originally been founded as an off-Broadway theater by philanthropist Alice and Irene in 1915, but closed in 1927. The following year, it reopened as the Neighborhood Playhouse School of Theater with the addition of Rita Wallish. Sanford Meisner joined the faculty in 1935 from the group theater. Meisner used his study of Russian theater and acting innovator Konstantin Stanislavski's system to develop his own technique as an alternative to Lee Strasberg's method acting, where it is now practiced by the great students who come here to learn. Well, I'm going to get ready now since tonight is June 14th and it's my birthday and we're all going out. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little segment and I'll see you later.